Hey, hello to everybody. Yeah. Yes, welcome to November. Yo, it's November. Yes, it's November. Uh. You already know what it is. Yeah, wait. You already know what it is. Speaking of November, what day is it? Uh, it's November 4. 4? November 5. Yeah! <laughs> Someone's legal. <laughs> yes, I am 18 already. And I can get... <laughs> <laughs> you can get in jail now. Yeah. <laughs> um... Um, I think now since I'm 18, um, 18 blue bills, please. Uh, Where's my 18 blue bills? 18 pamalo. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, welcome. Welcome to another PUF Youth. Yes. Uh, Whether you like it or not, it's our face. <laughs> <laughs> Always us at the first week and yeah, I'm blessed that um, another year has mm -hmm. added in my life. Uh, uh, okay. uh, no, not really. <laughs> And um, you know what? Uh, after this, after this youth, I will have to be sleep. I have to sleep early. Oh, sleep early! Because tomorrow uh. is a big day, last leg of the Philippine series Woo! of Sparta. And um, let's go. Let's, um, I hope I will not be the last anymore. <laughs> um, but yes. That's, that was close, but yes, welcome to everybody. How's everybody? No, 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 no. <laughs> How's everybody doing? I hope you guys doing well. No, 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 no. <laughs> yes, welcome, welcome, and welcome. Hi to everybody in the comment section. Yes. How are you guys doing? Yeah. Yes. Um, are your costumes ready? Uh, uh, ready? No. Yeah, it's uh, past, way past the yeah, Halloween. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, 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 April boy. <laughs> are your cost? Uh, how was your costumes? You know what? Um, what, 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 what attire did you wear? Yeah. What, what spooky? <laughs> yes, you know, you can wear any spooky thing. thing. You can have no, 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 uh, you could have worn anything. You yes. could, you could have worn. Yes. Yeah. The skin. Since, since it was pop so pop popular last night. Ah, uh, last night. Last, last month. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Squid Game. You know. Whoa. Whoa! Th that's the scariest <laughs> mask I've ever seen. Sir, face shield na lang po sir. Sir, para asa lang po face shield natin sir. Yes. Um. Yes. You know what? Face shield. Face shield. Um, you know what? This is this is the shield um, that I don't like really care about. <laughs> but yes, um, since you know Squid Game was so popular, yes. and um, I know I know lots of people who have worn that costume. Mm -hmm. It's so popular, and you know, um, <laughs> you know, triangle, square, <laughs> circle. I only got scared of those shapes in yes. geometry. <laughs> See. You know, Jai is an engineer. Yes. Because he's scared but of the never watch that show. You. Yeah. Yes. Why, 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 why are you not watching Squid Games? You're, you're so late, you know? It, it's, yes. been, it's been... I'll wait for one year before I... No, 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 no. <laughs> you're making a wrong, wrong, wrong mistake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wrong mistake. And, um... Um... Uh... Yes. Nothing else to say. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing yes. you can do. I, 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 other than that, since I'm a fanboy of League, it's already Worlds. Oh yeah, right, right, yes. right, right. Yes, Worlds season. Yes. T1, let's go T1. Let's go T1. Um, we'll, we'll never stop uh, supporting you. No, go C9, <laughs> NA, let's go. Do something, NA, do something. Um, Apparently, since it's November 5, oh. Eter Marvel's Eternals just released Today, well, uh, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm so powerful that Eternals went, went out the same day, November 5 also, my birthday. So cool. And, um, you know, because um, I, I was so intrigued about Eternals because of Angelina Jolie. Uh, Angelina Jolie fan, is like uh, one of my great crushes. <laughs> um, hi. <laughs> and, um, yes. yeah, I think we have to go straight to yes. something. Straight to our activity. Uh, yes, our activity. Our game. Our game. Yes. Um, I hope we don't get eliminated. Yeah. Yes, into the comment section. Yes. If uh, you are in the comment section, do something. <laughs> Choose your best fighter. <laughs> yes, you know, put down. Okay, 
put down an animal emoji. Okay? Yeah. Animal emoji. And you're no reason. your team. Yes. Oh, your team? Okay. Yeah, your team. It's either Team Jared or, or Team Poggy. <laughs> <laughs> No, man. Don't do kidding. Me like that. It's Team Jared or Team Chucky. Okay? Team Chucky. C H O K I. Yeah, so I'll and bring because, it up. Because of that, um, I want to call um, the, two, the two players, two other players that will be our teammates. That'll be one of our teammates. And we will have to do um, rock, paper, scissors. rock, paper, scissors to choose who from the two. Will we have our teammate? Because of that, let's introduce our our, our guests. other guests. Yes, we have yeah. here our game master, Mr. Worldwide, Christian. Yes. Ninong Dords. Christian Ninong Dords. Yes, <laughs> that's a cool name, Ninong Dords. You know what? Um, I think we should call on the next one. Yes, also a fellow November kid. Yes, November, and um, he is the best. Of the best. Yes. And we are calling Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Sexy Ken. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing? How did you? <laughs> Have no pay shield. Have no pay shield. Okay. Based on that, we will pick. Um, we'll do rock, paper, scissors to choose whether Saxy Ken or Nino Dords. Who will be your teammate? Let's go. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. No. You already know. I'll choose Jared's best friend, oh. Mr. Saxy Ken. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Jar I, I, will, I will put Jared with Saxy Ken because I know they're really best friends and they're so close. And they can't get enough of each other. Yes, best friend, best friend. Best friend, best friend. Christian, what? Um, why don't you explain to us what's your game? Yeah, it's um ping pong. Um, um, you 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 make you make bounce on on the cup on the table. And then you make you make uso with the cups, and then and then and then you um you make you make you make palet with your friend, and then they make uso as well with the with the boy. Yes. Okay. Cos consequence consequences. Um. I don't know. Eh? We'll we'll make it. We'll 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 go with it. No. no. <laughs> we'll not do. It. We'll ju we'll just go with how it is gonna. <laughs> Okay. So yes. Yes, I hope Sir you've Saskia understood. Is, is the, um, the demonstrating it. It goes that well. Um, so you just have to, you know, bounce the ball to the table, make sure it goes to the cup, move the cup here. If it goes in. If it goes, if if we if we win, we will win. Putting it here. If it's already here, they lose automatically. And we are we we are winners. <laughs> I think we should get this game started. Two. One, what? go! Ah, ah. I didn't move it. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> so fast. No. <laughs> yes! No, let's go! No. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry! It's only a practice game. It's only a practice game? Yeah. <laughs> Except your feet are ready, man. Okay, ready. ready. This is the real one. Real okay. thing. Let's go. Ready, set, go. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry. Oh, 
one, nice one, nice one. Let's go. I feel the rush. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice one, nice one, nice one, nice one. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. the game I have no eye hand coordination <laughs> that's an engineer engineer Yan. I work with machines <laughs> Christian what can you say about the game I'm just I'm, I'm, I don't know I'm just really hyped with the milky <laughs> hype with the milky uh, what can you say about me <laughs> best friend <I> hate you <laughs> <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> but still best friend best friend <laughs> best yes best friend, friend. Best friend, yes. because of that, <laughs> let's give a hand to us, yeah. the winners, you know. I win every day and never lose. All I born, do is win. Born a champion. Yes, born a champion. And because of that, um, I think we have to go straight to the praise and worship. Yes. So we'll leave it off to the band. Yeah. Band, let's go. Songs. Welcome to Youth Night. Come on. Now. 
In your freedom here I stay Letting go of all I am Jesus take control Come on! Oh, oh, oh Caught up in the middle of the embrace All I have surrendered on to your name Jesus, I'm forever singing your praise hey, 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 hey. No, we won't stay silent We will sing like never before Caught up in the middle of the embrace All I have surrendered love to your name Jesus, I'm forever singing your praise hey, hey, Caught up! I'm caught up in the middle of the embrace all I have surrendered on to your name Jesus, I'm forever singing your praise hey, 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 hey. Praise you God in this place, come on we praise Him
church with every voice we sing. So I stand with arms high, heart abandoned, in all of the one who gave it all. I stand with my soul, Lord, to you surrender. I am, is yours. I stand, come on. So I stand. Good evening, youth. All right, good evening, POF youth. Okay, what's up, POF night? Hey, everybody happy that it's November? All right, anybody happy it's November? Right? I'm happy it's November. All right, because it's one more month and we're on December. Anybody excited for December? All right, anybody excited for December? I remember like walking around the mall and then we like, oh, there are Christmas decorations already. See, as early as November, actually. Back way way back October there you know there are already some some Christmas trees and you know Christmas decorations out there so hey you know if you are happy to be in the month of November again all right put out a number in chat I right? put out a number all right rate your excitement to be in November all right let's give it a is it a one to ten good yeah I think one to ten is good. I want to then rate your excitement that it is November. Come on. All right, come on. We want to see that. All right, we want to see that. But anyways, okay. Anyways, um, it's a new month. And of course, a new topic. All right, new month, new topic. Always good that we have, you know, we're bringing something new to you guys. And, you know, it's always amazing that each month we learn something new. All right. And hey, um, what a better way to, you know, end the year, right? We're starting to end the year. We're closing the year and we're talking about Jesus. And you know, the title for this message is, uh, for not this, not this message, but this series rather, is Jesus 101, right? If you're, you know, if you're the type of person that takes down notes, 
on online church, God bless you. <laughs> Alright, God bless you. Alright, but yes, Jesus 101. Alright, Jesus 101. Alright, how many of you know the, the lyrics to the song, Jesus loves me? Alright, Jesus loves me. The, um, the kids song. Alright, the kids song. Right, because there's you know there's there's an adult version yeah no 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 there's a you know there's a, a modified song but the original song right you see Jesus loves me this I know right for the Bible tells me so do you know what all right little ones to him belong they are weak but he is strong yes Jesus loves me yes Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. All right, hey, all right. If you love that little, you know, that little song I sang. All right, the title is Jesus loves me. Man, anybody believes that Jesus loves you? All right, anybody who believes that Jesus loves you? All right, you know, we declare that. We thank God for that. Amen. That we, you know, we are alive through His grace, and you know, we thank God that He loves us. Amen. He loves us. All right. I'm sure many of you have been, you know, have sung that song already, all right? Since you're, you're old enough to sing it, all right? That's, you know, it's an old song, all right? Jesus Loves Me. It's one of the very first songs taught in, you know, kids' church, all right? Kids' church, okay? Kids' church, they know this, all right? It's a simple song, all right? With a simple message, all right? Simple message and the chorus especially, you know, as simple, is as simple as it gets, right? Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so, all right? See, we're starting a new series today. It's all about Jesus, all right? It's fitting to start the series by, you know, revisiting, all right? Revisiting our, you know, children's rhyme, our, you know, kids' church rhymes, all right? Because, you know, we're going to ask the question, what does the Bible tell us about Jesus, all right? And in the month of November, we're heading to December, and, you know, it has been a f- nearly a full year. Right, that we're having online youth and it's no actually it's more than a year right it's amazing that you know we are here at this moment right you know we've had you know we've come from um the drums to having no actually since online pandemic we have come from um music right i believe from uh, the band and you know it came down to um, this uh, a minimal setup and now it's come to a full band again alright so you know it's nice that we we understand who Jesus is alright and who he is in our lives right who is he right why did he come here what did he say right what did he do to back up his words in his work finished alright is his work finished is it still going? In other words, how does the Bible tell us that Jesus loves us? All right, today's scripture takes us to the beginning of Jesus' story, right? From, a peculiar, from his peculiar birth to his even more peculiar childhood, Luke, all right, the, in the Bible, all right, Luke, the apostle Luke, all right, his only disciple to give us this much detail on the baby boy, on the baby and boy Jesus, all right? Basically, when, baby, when Jesus was a baby and when Jesus was a boy, all right? And what he has to share reveals a great deal about the man the Bible, say, the Bible says, you know, loves us, all right? If you could, you know, Jared, could you flash um, Luke chapter 2, all right? In NIV, if you have, all right, so I'll go with King James, it's okay. Yeah, let's go with the whole chapter. Right, I'll read this passage, right? And then as it came to pass those days, right, that there went out the decree from Caesar Augustus, right, that all the world should be taxed. Just imagine this world power, right? This world power the Roman Empire had back then, right? And this taxing was first made by Cyrenius, or Cy- Cyrenius, right, was governor of Syria. And, and all went to be taxed, right? Everyone into his own city, and Joseph also went up from Galilee. I'm pretty sure this is a long chapter, right? This is until, yeah, 52, all right? So I'm pretty sure I'll be reading a first a part of this and I'll skip on to 50, all right? You got that? Okay. And Joseph also went up from Galilee 
at the city of Nazareth into Judea, unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and the lineage of David, right? to be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife, being great with child, all right? And, and so it was while they were there, all right, the, uh, the days were accomplished that she should be delivered, all right? She was about to give birth. And she brought forth her firstborn son, and wrapping him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. Let's go skip, all right? Let's go skip. This is the story of Christmas, by the way, right? And they understood not, right, the saying which he spake unto them, all right? And he went down with them and came to Nazareth and was subject unto them. But his mother kept all these sayings in her heart, okay? And Jesus increased in wisdom and stature and in favor with man, with God and man. God bless your word in Jesus' name we pray. And all of God's people said, amen and amen, all right? So basically the first part, was um, uh, us talking about Jesus' situation when he gave, when you know Mary gave birth uh, to him, all right? And the next part was when Jesus was a boy and Jesus actually spoke in the temple, all right? Okay, Jesus is born in the town of Bethlehem, the city of David. This is not his parents' hometown, but the home of Joseph's family, all right? Had it not been for the census, all right? Okay, that everyone had to come there. Right? Jesus would have not been born, would have been born in Nazareth. But there's a reason Jesus was born in Bethlehem. Because it was predicted by prophet Micah. Right? The Old Testament tells us many prophecies right, that were spoken about the birth of Jesus, right? the birth of the Messiah. And that every one of them came true. Right? God sent these prophecies through His messengers for two reasons. One, so we would know who God, uh, who the Messiah was when He came, and two, so we would know for certain that God had a purpose in sending Him. All right. You see, there has been many prophecies about you know Jesus coming down on Earth. All right, in the Old Testament, and this is proof. All right, this is proof. Right, God's word is proof that Jesus did come down here. All right, Jesus did come down here. To save, right, to save humanity. And you know, Jesus loves us. Amen. Have you ever, you know, have you ever told the world, I love you to someone? All right. No malicious thinking. All right. You know, we say, I love you to many people. I say, I love you. You say, I love you to your classmates, to your family, to your friends. All right. You know, all right. You say, you know, you know it's always a good feeling. All right. To receive the word I love you from someone, eh? Alright? It's, you know, it's uh, a special, right? It's something special. And I think, right? And I think, and I'm pretty sure, right, that it, you know, it holds something, you know, it holds a special place, you know, in your heart when someone tells you, I love you, right? Someone tells you, I love you, okay? Parents tell you, I love you. Uh, a significant someone tells you, I love you. A friend tells you, I love you. You know, it's you know, it's special, right? It feels very special to you, all right? And God came down on earth to tell you that. All right? God came down, right? He came here, right? God sacrificed Jesus, all right, for him to be able to tell you that he loves you. All right? He loves you. You may not feel it, but God loves you. All right? God loves you. You're alive. You're here right now because God loves you. All right? God then announces the birth of Jesus to a group of shepherds. These men of Israel have grown up hearing the prophecies of what we call the Old Testament, right? And they know exactly what the angel means when he tells them a Savior has been born. This is the promised one, the Messiah, the one who will save Israel. Give me one moment. I had to tie my shoelace because it was bur burdening me that I've been stepping on it. All right? Yes. You see, God's purpose is further revealed when Mary and Joseph take him to the temple. It was Jewish law that every child be presented at the temple. So, a young couple with a baby was not an uncommon sight for two of God's most faithful servants. However, the arrival of Jesus was the 
culmination of their lives. Simeon and Anna, right, both spoke of great things that Jesus would do later in his life. Finally, Luke takes us to a brief visit with Jesus, with the boy Jesus. Jesus was at an age when he should be running and playing with other children. Instead, we find him in the temple. And we find him in the temple confounding the men of God who have devoted their lives to reading the scripture. He is not yet a man. And already, Jesus is about the business of his father, fulfilling the plan God has set before him. You see, at his young age, right? I believe Jesus had his fun, right? I believe Jesus had his fun, you know. Jesus, you know, like every every young boy, I suppose, right? Would, you know, would have, you know, played real well, right? Would have played real well, you know, would have done and, you know, been an active kid, right? Because, you know, at least once played outside, all right? There's no internet back then, okay? There's no internet back then, so, you know, they, they had their means of playing, you know, games, all right? And of course, young Jesus, all right, believe he had his fun, all right? But, all right, although, although, you know, he, you know, being a young child, you're, you know, you're, your mind is playful, you know, you're, you, you, keep, you, you roam into things, right? But Jesus was, you know, was about the business, right? Jesus was about the business. He was straight, you know, to fulfilling what God, you know, has for him, right? There's one final thing that I want to point out from, you know, from the passage, right? If God had a plan for Jesus long before he was born, doesn't it stand to reason that he, has also, he also has a plan for you, right? If you believe that, all right, it's something to be happy about. God has a plan for you. Right? The Bible tells us that we were all made in the image of God, that He knew us before we were ever born. All right? I've only ever got to know you through youth, right? through fuel night. Okay? But God know, has known you ever since you were born. All right? Before you were born, before you were made, God knows you. All right? And again, as the Bible says, He calls us by our name. All right? doesn't matter who you are, whose child you are, where you are from, what you have done, God made you. All right? He knows you better than yourself. And just like Jesus, He who was destined to be our Savior, He has a plan for your life. All right? Believing in Jesus and making Him your own Savior is the first step to fulfilling that plan. All right? That's the reason why we had to do you a know, prayer of salvation. All right? Because, you know, we believe that God has a special plan for us in, in our hearts. We believe that God will move and God will work. Amen. Do you believe that? All right. Do you believe that tonight? You see, we, you know, what have you learned about Jesus, you know, as of this, this, this short passage, right? So, you know, Jesus is God's son. God had a plan for Jesus ages before he was born. Because come to think about it, God could have said, you know, Jesus in the Old Testament times, but you know, he let it wait the period, right? Before, you know, he sent finally sent Jesus Christ. Okay, God had the plan for Jesus ages, you know, before he was born. And from birth, Jesus was no ordinary child. He grew up like any other humans, but it was clear to all who knew him that Jesus was on a mission. Alright? God has a mission for you too as well. And a plan to use you to glorify His name. And if you place your trust in Jesus, God will begin unveiling His plans for you. All right? Your life here, you know, it is no joke. Your life here has a plan. It has a purpose. All right? Ask yourself. Right? Ask yourself, what is my purpose? All right? You know, those, you know, those things. What is my purpose? All right? I think, you know, we are heading to life. All right, we are heading to life. Some of us might be there already, okay? And you know, it's not too late to ask ourselves, what is my purpose in life? All right, what is my purpose in life? Because you know, as you're aging, you're not, you know, you're not just a carefree kid anymore, all right? You, you know, you're heading to, you're heading to adolescence, all right? Or adolescence, all right? And you know, 
you ask yourself, what is my purpose? What am I, you know, what am I here to do? All right? Because, you know, you're aging. <laughs> Whether you like it or not, time doesn't go backwards. All right? It all only does it goes forward. Okay? And you ask yourself, what is my purpose? And what is my purpose? I am however old you are, all right? Or in my case, I am 20 years old. Right? I'm 20 years old. And what is my purpose, right? I know I have a long way to run, but what is my purpose, all right? Because if you can't answer, you know, if you can't find that out as young as you are, all right, then you're going to have a hard time finding it, you know, in the future. Although you will find it, I believe, all right? But you have to understand, what is my purpose? Right? What is my purpose? And you know, it doesn't hurt to say, God, ask God, God, what is my purpose? All right? God, what is my purpose? Because if you would ask yourself, oh, what is my purpose? All right? What is my purpose? And I think, I believe it's only, it's us human beings who've been gifted by God with reason, with the ability to reason, all right? And to think, all right? To reason, all right? And, you know, think about it, right? We're gifted by God with this, you know, incredible, amazing gift to reason. And, you know, reason, right? Think about it. Why was, you know, why me? Right? Why am I where I'm at? Right? Why am I, you know, in, you know, taking this course, taking this program? Why am I doing this? Why am I doing that? All right? It, it's never... Uh, it never hurts to ask yourself that. Right? God, why am I doing this? Right? God, why am I doing this? Right? And you see, because if God, you know, if God, if God had a plan for Jesus, God has a plan for you as well. Alright? It may be, you know, to do something that no one else could. Right? It may be something, you know, it might be to share the gospel to someone you'll meet in the next 10 years who knows right who knows but god has a plan for you amen god has a plan for you and i need you to realize that i need you to understand that okay because you know if you can't if you haven't right if you haven't found that purpose if you haven't found that you know that that plan right that god has for you yet right? it's not yet too late Right, it's not yet too late. You're very young. Right? We are very young. Okay? Not only you. Right? We are very young. Right? We are very young. And, you know, we have a long stretch to go. Right? And we believe that God has a plan. Right? We believe that God has a plan for you and for me. And, you know, we thank God that we, you know, that He has a plan for us. Right? Because, you know, we believe that God has, the, you know, has set us for greater heights for greater destinations, right? You know, we are going to, you know, to exceed, to excel, all right? Because, you know, we believe in God. We believe in a God, in the great big God, all right? We believe in what He can do, in, you know, in what He has in store for each and every one of us. So, hey, if you believe that, right, why don't you join me in prayer, okay? Let's pray. God, we thank you for tonight we thank you for these things lord we thank you for reminding us about your plan for each and every one of us god we speak that if we if we may have not yet found our plan what you have for us lord may we find it god may we find what you have for us lord and we know that your hand and your plans is better way way better than ours god we know that you are going to work mighty things in our life we thank you god for these things in jesus name we pray amen and amen god bless you youth all right, thank you for an amazing first November. All right, we're going to head on to um, more, all right, as uh, November comes. So I pass this on to our dear hosts, all right, who's got an amazing, who's got amazing um, announcements, I believe, for us, if they do have. All right, so yeah, okay, so I'll pass them on, this on to them. So bye, guys. All right, God bless you. Peace out.
Yes, thank you. I think I think you are a youth pastor. What a wonderful message. You know what they always say. Wonderful word. Yes, I hope we learned lots of stuff. Yes, as what he said. Important announcements. None. No, um, Christmas is near. Yes, uh, next month. Yes, it's next month already. Um, uh, can't believe. Um, how many years have you been in the pandemic? Two years? It will almost be, almost be two years. It's almost two years. Yes. The two weeks became... Yes, <laughs> two, became yes. two years. Uh, two, uh, two months. One, one, two months. Extended one month. Yes, then then it became... Uh, yes, here we are. <laughs> yes, here we are. Almost uh, to the two-year mark. But uh, I'm still so grateful that um, we're still alive. You're still yeah. alive. You're still staying strong. Yes, and um, uh, uh, being provided by the Lord. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, what else? Um, what's your chance? Take it in. Um, but yes, um, if you guys have questions, inquiries, uh, please go check the Facebook page and Instagram. Yeah. Um, you know, just TikTok. leave a DM. Yeah, TikTok actually. Um, uh, uh, I know uh, there are already videos there, so why don't you visit it? I think it's PUF Youth. Hey, Christian, Christian, PUF Youth on the TikTok. No yeah. sp uh, space, capital P, capital Y. Um, that's the you know, if you missed uh, the past. Um, Youth night or whatever, like you, you miss the game, um, you can check it out there. Um, like what happened, what are the fun parts? Um, one. Yes, who won? <laughs> you know, always me, man. What do you mean? I always win. Um, it's like he only wins. Yes, uh, I never lose. Um, if ever I lose, he let them win. No, 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 no. Right. Uh, it's what you call experience. Uh -huh. Exposure, exposure. Oh, exposure. Exposure. And yes, we are thankful to uh, we are thankful that you guys stayed this long and uh, hope to see you guys next week. And Jai, yes. what, what one, one last thing. If you attend the uh, church Sunday services, please <laughs> put it down. <laughs> Prayer. <Yes>. Since, since <laughs> ready on Sunday. Yes. Um, ready, prepare for yes. it. Yes. Send it now in uh, uh -huh. BF Church and Facebook. <laughs> you know what? Before we leave to the comment section. Um, <laughs> if you're right, if you're there, if you're still there, if you're not sleeping there, um, why don't you leave a uh, hundred emoji, you know, the one hundred, and you can now leave. Fire, fire, yeah. <laughs> yes, you know, one hundred and the fire, 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 and you can now leave. No, I'm kidding. Um, but we are so thankful for you guys and uh, follow. Uh, <laughs> follow. <laughs> Next, uh, yes, we will still be here yes. until December, and we hope to see you there. Yeah. Let's go. See you next week, people. Bye. Bye.